Everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Tech. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to change your controller layout on your Steam Deck. So you can get different buttons or you can play games that don't support uh, the controller. So if it's just like a mouse and keyboard game like Battlebit or something like that, just press the Steam button on the left and this little menu will appear. So I get Rock the League opened up. I wanna go over to controller settings and go then you can see all the button layouts right here. Go to controller settings. Then go up the top, current button layout. So a lot of times you'll just have a default one for the game. But you can go to templates right here. These are just default ones as well that you can try using if you want to make your own. But most of the time, the community will have a layout for it. So Rocket League doesn't have one at all, but you can just go to the community layouts. It tends to be the best if it's a non-supportive game. Like Battle Bit was really good. They had a bunch of layout. But all you have to do is switch on over to it. So gamepad with joystick or trackpad right here. Just press apply on the bottom. And then it will apply the new layout for you. And you can also just switch back and forth. So you got your layouts, templates, community layouts. So here's the one I was using before. We can just apply this one back and select it. Then we can go to Ed lay Layout if we want to change the back buttons. So it looks like the back grips don't have anything on them. You can see they're all disabled. And then we can go to the joysticks a lot of times. I would like to make sure my dead zones are zeroed out. So, yep, they're at one right now or zero pretty much. So I'm actually more accurate in my games. And in BattleBit, this was working quite well. So. I can press the Steam button down here, or let's go back to Steam, and I can see everything here. So if I force close the game now, let's hold down Steam plus B, and then go back to the main menu here. If I go to Battle Bit, uh, this will make the game work a little bit easier for me. So let me just quit out of here, and press this. And we'll switch on over to battle bit. So here it is. You can go to the controller layout before you even start the game. And here is the community templates or the options right here. You can see the play hours. This one has 8,000 play hours on it. And this one works even though it's just a mouse and keyboard game. So yeah. It was working pretty good. You can see the layout before you apply it too. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your Six Tech.